Imagine a world beneath the waves where vibrant coral reefs thrive, jellyfish float gracefully, and colorful sea anemones sway with the currents. Did you know that some of the most captivating marine creatures, like jellyfish and corals, share a very ancient connection? These fascinating organisms belong to a unique group known as Phylum Coelenterata, or Cnidaria, and they have existed in the ocean for over 500 million years. Join us as we dive into the mesmerizing world of coelenterates and uncover the secrets of these simple yet beautiful creatures. Let's explore the key characteristics of coelenterata. Coelenterates have a simple body structure with two layers of cells, an outer layer called the ectoderm and an inner layer known as the endoderm, separated by a non-cellular jelly-like substance, the mesoglea. These animals exhibit radial symmetry meaning their body parts radiate out from a central axis. This structure allows them to interact with the environment from all directions, an adaptation perfect for life underwater. A key feature is their central digestive space, or gastrovascular cavity, with a single opening that serves both as a mouth and an exit for waste, a simple yet efficient design. Types of body forms. In coelenterates, there are two basic body forms polyp and medusa. The polyp form, like in hydra and corals, is cylindrical, sessile, and often attached to surfaces. The medusa form, like in jellyfish, is umbrella-shaped and free-floating, allowing it to drift with ocean currents. Both forms are beautifully adapted to their habitats. Feeding and defense mechanism. One of the most extraordinary features of coelenterates is their specialized stinging cells called snidocytes, which contain nematocysts. These tiny, harpoon-like structures can shoot out and release toxins, helping these animals capture prey and defend against predators. Section 4. Classification of Coelenterata. Hydra and Portuguese. man o war belong to the class Hydrozoa, which includes both polyp and medusa forms in their life cycle. The true jellyfish fall under Cyphozoa. They are primarily found in the Medusa form and are known for their beautiful floating bodies. Anthozoa includes corals and sea anemones, which exist only in the polyp form. These animals play a crucial role in forming coral reefs, providing habitats for countless marine species. Importance of coelenterates. Coelenterates, especially corals, are vital for marine ecosystems. Coral reefs support a diverse range of marine life, protect coastlines, and contribute to biodiversity. Additionally, coelenterates are also important in research, helping scientists understand nerve function and evolution. So, that was a deep dive into the amazing world of Phylum Coelenterata. From their ancient origins to their simple but efficient body structures, coelenterates reveal just how much life can achieve with such simplicity. Next time you see a coral reef or a jellyfish, remember, these seemingly simple creatures hold secrets that have fascinated scientists for centuries. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay curious with science animations.